Hello, and welcome to Wasp 3D Feature Tutorials. In the following tutorial, users will learn how to create real-time reflection of objects with a blur, in Drone Designer. In the first part of this tutorial, we will show how real-time reflections can be created using Render Texture. Here, we are using a preset template with all elements in a group to create floor reflections. We begin by creating a rectangle and placing it over the chessboard. Increase rectangle's height and width, or scale it to fit the chessboard. Next, we select Deflector Plane on which the reflections will be cast and copy the rectangle's transformation attributes to it. This is how it can be done. Go to Object Pool, shortcut key F3, and simply drag and drop transform button to copy transformation. Another way to do this, is to go to Hierarchy Pool, shortcut key F9. Right click on object to copy transformation, and paste it on deflector plane. We then rename the object. Next, we create a uniform material and apply it on the rectangle, by dragging and dropping it over the object. Alternate way to do this is to right click on the object and select set material. We then rename the material. We then go to texture pool, shortcut key F6 and select the render texture. We add it to the texture layer, and set it to x-ray mode. Next, we select the Reflection checkbox, and select the Deflector Plane as Mirror Plane. Select the desired elements to be reflected on the floor. Hold down the Shift key, to make multiple selections. Right-click the selection, select Render and then the Texture. Toggle the transparency of the material and texture, to achieve the desired look of reflection. Lastly, we change the blending mode to normal P, and set the diffuse color to black. Now let's show how the blur effect can be achieved on the reflections. From the texture pool, we select the blur texture and drag and drop it to texture layer 1, instead of render texture. We define render texture as a source texture for blur. Next, the shader type offers various blur shaders for users. For this template, we select Gaussian blur. Finally, in the blur parameters, modify the blur size and the desired look for floor reflection can be achieved. 